What is up, Inator Army? I am GameNator5 coming at you with a brand new video. Welcome back to uh, Inatorcraft Season 2. Um, yeah, uh, it's been a while since I've played. Since I've played. Since uh, we. Ma since I've made a video of this. <laughs> well, since I've made a proper video in general, it's been a while. Anyway, um, welcome back to Nadercraft Season 2. Um, it, the last time we uploaded this was September, and it's now November 21st that I'm recording this. Well, actually, more so, it's our anniversary uh, week, so. Yeah, that's bad. Um, uh, as you could, uh, I said I recorded this on the 21st of November. Well, uh, there is, uh, and, uh, our anniversary is 30th, and it start, the actual celebration starts on the 26th. Well, I have a very good explanation as to why I'm doing this starting now. I have to record two of these episodes. These episodes could take quite a while to make. So, uh, but... Before we get in, before we get into everything, to, before we do what I want to do today in this episode, we have to uh, start off by number one, changing back to survival mode. <laughs> and um, I'm here at where I'm going to be building my actual main base for uh, season two. As you, if you didn't see episode one, we decided, I decided to choose. The tundra, it, the north tundra, as my main uh, home for the season. So I I can set up my major base here. I can also set up bases in all the other um, places also, but um, I have to set one up here, and um, bef mostly. Probably before we even go anywhere else. But, um, I have done some, uh, messing around with, uh, with an idea for, um, for what I want to do for my base. And I have, uh, come up with it. I've, uh, I finally, I literally built it in a creative world. So... Over this episode and the next episode, we will start, uh, preparing to, uh, start building the base. Um, well, at least the first part of it. It's going to take quite a while to build. I could build it in a day. But, um, yeah, uh, well, actually, no, I could build, I built it, I built it in the creative world in two days. Now, we are allowed using creative here, but, um, we need to have access to stuff. So, um, I'm going to be working on that today, but, um, mostly what we're going to be working on today is, uh, well, that right there. Now, last episode, we did a, one of the, our first ever challenge of, uh, this season. And that was to build the North Shop's, uh, watchtower. Uh, so, we built that. I like, I love the look of it. Um, maybe we'll head over there, uh, a little bit later in this episode. But this is what I'm wanting to work on today. Um, I think it could, uh, uh what I want to do with this is make it look like our, look, Kind of like what our base will look like. And they'll probably connect it when the base is done. So, uh, yeah. I will tell you the idea I have for my base is a bunch of towers. I, I don't know why. I, I feel like I just want to have a bunch of towers. So, yeah. And... The, the weird thing is, I still want to use, co I want to use concrete for it. Concrete is hard to come, come to get, uh, without, uh, having sand and gravel. So, uh, we're gonna need to find a mountain. 
And we're going to find a desert that is not going to be used later. <laughs> so, with that, I'm going to, uh, we're going to go see if there's anything over there. Uh, f from us completing our challenge on last episode. And, uh, yeah. Besides that, uh, nothing really is changed on, uh, in the world, other than, um, the preparation for Christmas countdown in the, uh, West Tundra, I'm pretty sure. There is a West Tundra, we're not there, we're nor we're the North Tundra. So, uh, yeah. So, okay, come on, come on, okay. And, uh, the challenge area is actually over here, where the beacon is. I know I could have probably taken the boat over there, but... <laughs> ah. I don't care. <laughs> you know, something that might come in handy in this, because, uh, we're in the north. Might be useful getting a frost walker on our boots, so that we can, uh walk over walk on water and we actually do have something ooh 64 shop tokens ooh that's handy we spent half a stack of uh, shop tokens uh, in the last episode so that is very handy that is how we get stuff on the server for you yeah server <laughs> that is how we get stuff in in, in uh, that we, uh, in the shops, that's how we get stuff, and at least north shops, we don't have tokens for, uh, south, uh, east, or west yet, because we have not gone there, and we need mega tokens to get there. Um, there is n not, um, challenge for, uh, mega tokens yet, so, uh, the, those are, uh, take a little bit more work, <laughs> so. My, I would pass. Yeah, there's my base. My little igloo. <laughs> okay. So. Oh, I spent over a stack. Okay. So we have the stack in 28. Of uh, tokens now. Was of sixteen snowballs. Um, we have a lot of stuff. <laughs> so um, uh, so like I said, sorry if I'm if I'm kind of lo lost a little bit. I haven't done a video in so long, so, um, today we will, uh, build that tower, I want to get that done so we can have two new challenges, uh, for the next couple episodes, want to get that done, but to get that done, I need to go get some materials, so, with that, let's actually head to the shopping area, and I could, if you didn't see it, I will show you, uh, what we built. Uh, last episode. Um, I haven't done anything to it. So, um, yeah. I need to figure out how we're going to get concrete. <laughs> this might be difficult. <laughs> but yeah, there's the hub. I'm going to cut. And I'll see you guys when uh, we actually get to um, the uh, area. When we get to the 
uh, shops. When we get to spawn. <laughs> I will, I will be back. Yeah. Okay, so I've reached the, uh, portal. That's it, right there. Um, I just wanted to show you this. Uh, this is the, uh, path to, uh, the Christmas, uh, village. Can't go there yet, it's actually not built. But that's, uh, the direction it is. So, um, yeah. So, uh, see, what do we have here? So, I didn't bring the tokens, I'm not really gonna be buying anything. I can go back if I need them, but, um, currently I don't, I don't think I will. But, uh, first things first, this is what we built last episode. Um, this is the North Watchtower, and it's really big. <laughs> um, the North Shops Watchtower. I'm not gonna build the other tower today, like this one, as, uh, this one is, uh, kind of different so uh yeah as you can see I did use concrete here so I might still use concrete today but um I I do want to make it look like our what our base will look like I haven't tested but it uh, designed yet so I might n I, the reason why I'm recording this so early in advance on the 21st is because I want more time to be like uh, testing things for the build and that uh, I'm wanting to do in this episode. So, um, yeah. Um, what we need is concrete. And that is like the main thing we need today. So we need gravel, we need sand, and we need red and gray dye. <laughs> I have no idea how to get gray dye. I know how to get red. You need a flower. You know what I should have done? I should have made a dye shop. But yet, I probably wouldn't be able to access it because it would probably be in the dark, which is wet. Uh, east. Sorry. So, um, I'm gonna be searching the fields for probably a literal. Oh! And that for dumb luck. Poppies, let's go. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I don't even know how much I need, but this is amazing. Grab all this. I am going to need to look up how to get gray dye <laughs> because I literally don't know. Even though it is one of the most, uh, is the block that I use the most on, uh, the Nair Village server <laughs> with our logos and stuff. But, um, I don't know how to craft it. <laughs> We already have 30 poppies. I want a stack. <laughs> the good thing is this is in a plains and plains has a lot of flowers. I know there is a flower, um, a, like a flower forced island. I don't know how to get to there though. I know bone meal would probably make this a lot quicker. Um, I'm not doing that though. I ain't that smart. Oh! Let's go! Okay. 
Okay, I'm I'm happy that I'm getting very lucky with uh, finding poppies. I can hear it. Yeah, I'm not staying up there. <laughs> as soon as I hear a spider, I turn the other way. <laughs> I don't like mobs. <laughs> I have 42, so we're close to calling it a day. I might collect the rest of these off camera, but this, uh, this, uh, this might actually, uh, be enough. 54! 55! <laughs> oh! 56! Fifty six total flowers. That's a lot of flowers. Oh, is that a really big cave? Yeah, I think that's probably where the spider is. <laughs> I think fifty six is gonna be good. But, uh, that still won't do it, we need gray. <laughs> I have no idea how to get gray, and I'm probably going to, uh, cut here, figure that out, and, uh, um, I'll be back. Okay, so, back. So, I know what I need to get it, and I don't know if it's physically possible. Uh, you need gray and, uh, you need bone and, uh, ink sac. Now, inks, uh, ink sac is very easy, easy to come across. Uh, bone, not so much. <laughs> so, I might, uh, break my rule and actually <laughs> just spawn that in. <sighs> That's annoying. <laughs> so, I didn't know that. Honestly, I didn't. So, that would do. <laughs> um, I do actually need black, so we need squid, so. Uh, let's go find some squid to kill. <laughs> then we'll need a lot of gravel and sand, and that'll probably be just the grind laps that we, that we do. There's no squid in this! I know there's a lot of squid back home, so we might just head home. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna head home. Um, we got 56, uh, poppies that should smelt to make, um, uh, red dye. I think. Or is it like this? Oh! 56! Uh, we just made a bunch of red dye. <laughs> so, it's, I guess now, uh, before we head back and start killing some squids for black dye, uh, it's time to do, like, a little time lapse to, uh, get some resources, get some gravel, get some sand, and, uh, let's, uh, let's hit it. Let's hit it, I guess. Uh, 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 I had my mic up. <laughs> okay, uh, so, um, well, I forgot to record it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so, I, I, I didn't go that long. I didn't feel like I needed that much. So, uh, long man. So, I grabbed a, I mined a stack of each, uh, a stack of sand and a stack of gravel. Don't know how much that's gonna give us, but, uh, we, we have it now. So, um, 
Now when you black. <laughs> Me ink. I know I saw a squid around here earlier, so another around here. You know what? Let's go make the uh, red concrete and we'll be back. I can't see a single squid right now. I did see one earlier, so, uh... I might not need one right now, that... I might not need black, but I, it is a key part of my base uh, palette. So I think it would come in handy <laughs> to have... Uh, that, and I want uh, the tower to look kind of similar to what my base would look like. So, um... Yeah. I don't think I will build it uh today while when I'm building when I'm actually recording all me grabbing the materials and stuff. So um mostly because I want to test what I'm going to do. I'm not a hundred percent sure what I'm going to do yet. <laughs> I want it to look like my ba what my base will look like, but um I don't know how I'm going to scale it back because the base is really big. But, um, I'm very curious. I have never made concrete powder. Oh, okay. What the? Okay, well, that was stupid. <laughs> Literally just waiting. Okay. Okay, that's a stack. We got two stacks of red concrete powder. Woohoo! <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> that. Oh my. Hello, sheep. <laughs> so, two stacks of concrete powder. Um. I'm now going to do some testing, figure out what the heck I'm going to want to do as the design. And, um, I'm probably going to call it and I'll return tomorrow and finish and actually build it. Get that squid! After I get the squid, I'll call it a day. <laughs> Because even if I find a skeleton, I still need squid. <laughs> oh God, I'm going to die. <sighs> Okay, yeah, black die. Oh god. I'm literally chasing a squid in a boat.
I've got three. I don't know if I collected that one. We are going to need a new sword! Oh! Okay, there we go. Hello, Mr. Squid. You wanna come up? No? Okay. So we now have five black die. <laughs> but the issue is now I have no sand. So what the heck am I gonna do? <laughs> Still gonna kill this uh, this squid right here. Okay. Back to having three. Okay, we have eight. I think that's gonna do it. I'm going to uh, do some testing now. <laughs> got enough. I got enough. I'm gonna need to go get. I'm gonna need to get some more sand and some more gravel and more stuff to actually accomplish <laughs> our goal um so uh for you guys it will be like a second for me it'll be tomorrow pretty much so with that i'm gonna call it here i'm gonna do uh some figuring out and uh yeah this is why i record these all in advance because i take quite a while to uh, gather stuff and build stuff. So I will. S I'm going to cut now. I'm going to do some uh, designing, and uh, I'll be back. <laughs> okay. So it's been a couple days. Uh, <laughs> a couple more than I wanted, but um, I have gathered all the resources. I'm on the island now. Uh, this is uh, the, what is currently the watchtower. This will not be the watchtower after today. So, um, let's just show you the resources. I'm just gonna work on the outside for today, and uh, we'll work on the inside on the next episode. As uh, I still I need something to do on that episode besides gather resources for uh, the big build. So, um, yeah. Uh, this is the resources we gotta work with. We got three stacks of black, which I should've got another. Uh, I did spawn in the gray, but, uh, we have two stacks of gray, uh, pow concrete powder, three stacks of red, three stacks of black. So, we have a good amount of resources. The only thing we need now is, um, is wood, but that's for the inside and I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to use half slabs so that it so that mobs don't spawn. <laughs> I think that's actually a really smart idea. So uh this could take quite a while this will probably take quite a while. Uh so I'm prepared. I have everything my boat is literally sitting right there. Uh old watchtower right here. I got, uh, I got food, I got, uh, logs. I'm using my other mouse because my other mouse died. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, with that, uh, I, I think I'm just gonna hit, hit it and let's go into the mode! <laughs>
come back. Uh, yeah. So, I have no idea how long that took. <laughs> I think it probably took like an hour. I think. Um. So, this is now the North Watchtower. I'm still in creative mode. Now, in my view, I did a good job. This is kind of the same design that we will be using um, for uh, the main base. Which I think, uh, I think I did a good job coming up with this design. Now, I do want to say this. The design I actually didn't uh, come up with uh, fully. <laughs> Like, I didn't come up with it, like, right off the bat. Um, this design has actually been used before. And I've actually used it before on, uh, the server. Now, when we actually build the base, I will, uh, show you guys where on the server it's used. Uh, it's one of the least used buildings on the server, so I thought, you know what? Why the heck not? <laughs> I thought, why not use it for um, a world that I'm going to be uh, needing a big base for. And uh, this is just the watchtower. The base is going to be a lot bigger than this. But um, I'm really liking it. I'm really liking the look of, um, of, uh, of the tower and... I, I might even uh, just stay here now as my as I get my base built, but um Yeah, now that that's done. I think I probably am gonna call it here I'm going to want to put some snow around here, but that's something for off-camera so with that guys I Am probably gonna leave it here. I probably will also remove all the sand to make it dirt so uh, let's head back up. Uh, well, actually, first let's uh, grab our shulker box of materials. And next episode, we will start the um, process of getting all the materials to build our main base. I think I now know that this will take that the main base will probably take quite a while to build. And if you noticed during the time lapse, I stopped for a bit. I was actually following. Uh, I actually had my creative world open on my laptop, and I was following it. So I, I was building it pretty much what I wanted. So if I'm doing that for my main base, this is going to take a while because the main base is huge. And pretty much is the exact same design. From the from from this angle, the the little the eyes on the top, it looks like they're like antennas. It's actually kind of funny. <laughs> anyway, with that, um, let's uh, head back to the let's get back in uh, the igloo. And I will call it a day. I don't know how long this video is. It's taken quite a few days to build, to make. So. So, with that guys, I'm going to call it here. Thank you all for watching another episode of an aircraft. Hopefully we will be back more often. There's another one in, uh, uh, anniversary. I, I have not started recording, obviously, because this one's not done yet. But, with that, next episode we will gather some resources, start gathering resources to build our mega base for this season in, well, at least the main base in the tundra. Uh, well, main base in, main base in the north. We will have a main base in all areas, but uh, I will get into that in the next episode. With that, guys, I'm giving you a five. Signing off. See you later in the army. Stay cool and have fun, and I hope to see you all in the next video. 
Goodbye!